Hello guys and for today's video I'm gonna be teaching you on how to bring back 16.6 .6 when you upgraded your system to 17 and up because for me it didn't, it didn't work and I, I think it didn't work for you as well so let me help you with that so without wasting time let's get started So before we start, I would like to say that we are not using the screen recorder in my laptop. I'll be using my camera, my camera itself because we are going to restart the, the computer and I think screen recorder won't work because we're turning it off and turning, turning it on and that's it. So let's get started. So um, before we start, we need to go to file explorer um, to trace the um, we need to trace your old AMD software. Just go to AM. I mean AMD. Just go to AMD, and probably you can see the other system um, softwares that was downloaded by the system. And the oldest software is um, probably your default um, software, and you need to copy that and install it um, after doing the video uninstall. So if you cannot see it in the OSC. You probably need to go into your um, program in files and go to AMD. Um, just keep on searching until you see. And if you don't see or this is blank at all, um, I'll just let you know that um, in the. I'll just let you know that later um, when I'm starting the steps on how to solve this problem. So let's get started now. So, so first of all, um, first you need to plug your system and. So probably when you are in 17.7, you, you probably cannot open the AMD screen settings like this. So let's just wait. So you probably cannot open stuff like this, like that, and so on. So the system that, that is the default for this system is, is as it says there it's um it's 16.6 .6, um reading software is so the default um system version is the 16.6 .6, and this is the only version i think works in this system so comment down if you know under other version that works um 17 and above so let's get started and in bringing this up so first of all all you need to do is download um, DDU uninstaller so first let's go here so this is how the DDU uninstaller um, looks like I'll leave the download link in the description so after you download it um, open it up so let's just wait so it, um, it says like this just say yes after you say yes This um, thing should appear so uh, Updates are available So we'll not update that. Um, we'll just update it later. So um, launch option So this is a very important thing guys. So first is you go to safe mode um, That's it. It's recommended and then you go to reboot to safe mode. So we'll be doing that right now. So that's it. Probably you'll see that closing option starting tips on that's it. and our system now is just starting. So let's just wait. So this should take up some time. So you can see me there. Um, hello. There you go. This is in search of incredible. Just wait. After the system restarted, um, it should give you it should give you the password for your account, which is the complete password. So I'm gonna be typing my password. So 
so don't worry if this happens so the resolution probably did change there you go it changed and don't worry about this so first all you need to do is this one so it probably detected your system correctly so there you go AMD that's it so all you need to do is clean and restart highly recommended of course so don't worry about this this is not a virus error or anything like that so click on click and restart that's it so it should restart your system um, after a few seconds after a few seconds so let's just wait again okay restarting so this is all matters in the uh, RAM of your system so for me I upgraded this to um, 8 gigabyte RAM so I'll type my password again there you go so there you go so it should probably bring back the resolution of your system so let um so don't worry about this um first you need to go to your documents again so a lot of you guys um are asking for the links of the 16.6 version of the reading settings so you probably can see that um in the osc osc yes osc and go to amd yeah probably if you have downloaded um, several AMD Radeon settings, you probably can see it here. As for me, I only upgraded the system, but yeah, after upgrading it, um, I used the DUN installer, and you probably cannot see anything um, Radeon system software which is downloaded here. Only the this software, which is the 16.6, I believe. Yes, this is 16.6. That's only a date there. 16.11.5, um, November 25. So I don't understand why it's 16.11.5. Although my system not, right now is 16.6. So keep in mind that you cannot open your AMD's um, radiant settings as for now because you don't have um, AMD graphics card installed. A I mean AMD graphics installed. So. So for the second step, um, you need to download the the um, this one. You need to download um, this um, AMD Radeon system software. So I'll leave that down in the description. If you don't know your system software, I mean your AMD Radeon settings. Um, if you don't know how to auto detect, I'll teach you that later. So as for now. Um, um, just click and then you should find this and just say yes and then this one this is very important so you need to click install it should extract the files um, which is needed by the system so let's just let's so let's just wait So this um, thing matters if you have 8GB, uh, 4GB or even 16GB so this all matters in the, in the RAM speed So it should install your system um, software So it should install your Radeon Software Crimson Edition um, 16. Six, not the 16.11.5. I believe that's just a date for me, but I don't know. Let me let me know if you know in the comment down below. So done. Um, your AMD installer is already analyzing your system. So let's just minimize this thing and focus on this thing. So you probably have the choices there. Um, 
As for me, I don't need the package all because I don't need the application profiles. And there you go. All I need is the, uh, this one, the check, AMD display driver, HDMI audio driver, and AMD rating settings and AMD settings branding and AMD installer, um, I mean AMD install manager, so just click on Um, So the video just cut right now because um, I'm, I just ran out of storage and I have to delete um, some, some files that I don't need. So that's it, I just, I click install and this is the installation progress right now. So let's just skip this. Um, I'll be back when the. Let's just skip this and I'll be back um, when the installation progress is already done. So after the installation, um, you'll get this um, two choice. We whether to restart now or restart later. So we need and we must do restart later. I mean restart now. So just restart the system now and I did the mistake, I'll well, go. So last step, you need to go to your settings, go to update security, and this is all you need so you probably can get this um, update status where some of this but we'll try again. Okay, so retry or or check for updates if you have that kind of option just click on that it will automatically um, download the RS, um, AMD um, softwares if you haven't um, updated these settings so you probably cannot um, open the AMD reading settings yet it will say reading settings are currently not available please try again after connecting a display to AMD graphics and extending at the display so it's starting to download now so it won't open unless the update is already done. So when we did the DDON installer, um, it just resets the advanced micro device and uh, it just reset the AMD Radiant R7 graphics, which we needed in order to open the AMD Radiant settings. So downloading right now. I mean downloading updates. So this all matters if your connection is fast or slow. So if it's slow, just wait until it, it's done. As for our connection, it's not that fast. You probably need to update three Radeon stuffs, which is the uh, which is the R Radeon TM RX 460 graphics, um, R7 graphics, and adap gra graphics adapters. I'll be back when the up downloading updates is already done. So this should appear the system settings change. Your hardware settings have changed. Please reboot your, your computer for these changes to take effect. So just click on OK. That's not a big deal at all. So preparing to install updates 33% um, um, so we're already installing um, the RX 460 graphics There you go So a while ago this screen just flicker um, It's just normal if you're if you're updating the graphics um, graphics software graphics system um, versions so if you need to check for updates, um, just click for updates and I think I don't need that and let's just minimize this um, let's just minimize this for us for my case and click on refresh and your AMD Radeon um, settings should work and open just like this and check if you have updates and currently install this update and just click on system to know the version okay it's 16.6 .6 as expected and software on um, okay nothing uh, really changed because I just don't I just installed um, the same version and all we need to do as for the final step is of course restart your system and then Already there, so let's test. Um, 
Okay, so AMD settings. Um. So I guess I solved your problem. And if you have um, questions, um, just feel free to comment that down in the comment um, section down below. And please help me get um, 150 subscribers. And like if you like the video. And see you on the next video. Um, thanks for watching. And also, if you have any recommended um, th things that I need to do, let me know. Suggest if you like. And that's it. As always, um, thanks for watching. This is Active Now. Um, see you on the next video.